Hey YouTubers, uh, Flat Earth believers, Globers, subscribers of my channel, thanks for uh, visiting this uh, YouTube video again. I hope you like it. Have fun. Hey people. <laughs> um, this uh, channel, Electro Boom, uh, with 1.9 million subscribers, is a very funny um, YouTube channel. Uh, you should check that out. And I came across um, a video of uh, a Dutch professor uh, who I used in some of my videos because he gives very nice um, physics explanations, Dr. Uh, Professor Walter Lewin, a Dutch guy teaching in the US at uh, MIT or did teach at uh, MIT. Um, and, and this guy is in a fierce discussion and I first saw uh, Doctor uh, of Professor Lewin's uh, video. Then I went back and then I found him as the reason why the professor is getting angry but or agitated. And the funny thing is what the professor says. But first, let this guy do a little bit of his talk because he's funny as well. He's a good, good YouTuber. Hi. Making this video makes me nervous. This is a serious and complex video about an electronic topic and I have to do it very carefully. See, it's like you disagree with Stephen Hawking. Who's likely wrong? You are. And now I'm about to disagree with Dr. Walter Lewin. If you don't know Dr. Lewin, he has a PhD in physics. He's a former professor of physics at the Massachusetts Institute of Technology or MIT. He has made many discoveries, has written tons of books, has received many awards for his scientific achievements, has educated thousands in schools and millions over the web through his online lectures. Just check his Wikipedia page. I, on the other hand, have a master's degree in electronics, have worked for a while as an engineer and then turned YouTuber where I constantly get shocked <laughs> <laughs> that's the fun of his uh, channel so the real matter what they discuss about is uh, probably way too complicated for uh, the average flat earther and you would even wonder what uh, hell has this to do with flat earth um, it all has to do with the law of Kirchhoff Faraday's law and Maxwell's equations and that is about how currents um, behave and voltages behave when you have a closed circuit. Um, now we're going to look very short at a part of the reply of the professor to the claims uh, he makes. Again, it is of no interest what the real discussion is, but listen to what the professor says. Oh, and by the way, already thanks for watching and if you haven't done it please sub the button will be at the end of this video that you say Kirchhoff Yuku always works that means this one doesn't work you have to replace Faraday's law by this one you have to change Maxwell's equations if you say Kirchhoff Yuku always works it is equivalent to saying the earth is flat. <laughs> <laughs>